Faye Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at pattyfernandezartist.com. Okay, let's draw. Today's project is how to draw a beaker. I take three fingers in the top, in the middle, and I put a dot. And from that dot, I'm going to draw a flat oval. Come down a little, uh, right underneath, we're just going to mimic that bottom line again. Okay? And now, starting on the left, I draw a straight line down straight diagonal out little curved line at the bottom now on the right hand side straight line down straight diagonal over little curved line at the bottom come to the left and let's do a straight line over to the right connect I'm going to come on the left again and draw another little straight line connect on the right inside I'm going to start right about here and I'm just gonna do some wavy 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 lines and now I'm gonna do it again wavy 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 line and once more wavy 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 line connect okay come down to the bottom and we're going to draw one circle come up a little bit we're going to draw a smaller circle come up a little bit more draw some baby circles that's on the bottom part now come up to the top part and we're going to draw a circle a medium circle Let's do two of those and some baby circles. Okay? I come to the left hand side and I'm going to draw little dotted lines going down on the left, come down to the bottom, and we're going to do some little straight lines going across the bottom all the way. Okay? I think that's all. All right, let's see how we're going to color this in. Okay, a beaker is usually used for science, for experiments, or it can be used in a lab for some kind of mad scientist experiment. So I took a light sea green and I colored my main goo, whatever this is, inside my beaker. I color, colored mine green. Now, you might have another color in mind that is perfectly okay. I am not a scientist. This is pretend, okay? But I do like these colors because they're kind of goo oriented. Then I took a blue green and I colored in my bubbles. And again, these can be any color you want these are just the colors that I chose and I did this middle section blue green like I said weird science experiments beakers mad scientists laboratories okay alright let's see what this looks like all colored in okay here's my beaker all colored in with green goo waiting for the mad scientist to finish his experiment. This would be fun to do um, maybe a written story on starter. Okay, bye bye.